A lot of nights we are just busy and want to eat and this is the salad to make because it's so simple. Welcome to the channel where we talk all things plant-based, holistic health and wellness. My name is Lauren. I have a bachelor's degree in nutrition and six years of living plant-based under my belt. And if you are into whole food, plant-based living, if you are into health and wellness and clean, non-toxic living, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss a video. Today, I am so psyched to share a recipe with you that is literally like a gold standard uh, in my dinner repertoire. I literally make this salad sometimes five nights a week because it's so simple. So first of all, the star of the salad is kale. And kale is one of the most nutrient dense foods on this planet. This salad is about four ingredients. That's it, it's so easy to make. You can make this under five minutes. And I just wanted to share this with you because on most nights I'm making this. I love to make a fancy salad and have, you know, all kinds of ingredients and nuts and different dressings and blah, blah, blah. But a lot of nights we are just busy and want to eat. And this is the salad to make because it's so simple. So you need kale, which you're going to get a ton of vitamin A, K, C. You're going to get a ton of antioxidants with. You need avocado, which is such a healthy fat and so good for us. You need liquid aminos so if you've never tried liquid aminos there's kind of two kinds there's coconut aminos and soy aminos so coconut is made with fermented coconut sap soy aminos is made by breaking down the soy into free amino acids and the soy that i use which is bragg's is not genetically modified so you don't have to worry about any kind of weird science project food i like both soy and coconut i find the coconut to be a little sweeter but both will work for this recipe i also use hot sauce in this recipe but don't worry if you don't like spicy whatsoever just completely leave the hot sauce out of this completely not necessary and you can also get creative and in place of the hot sauce you could add a spice or I mean not something spicy if you don't like spicy but just get creative add whatever seasoning you really like so that's it hot sauce aminos, avocado, and kale, and you have yourself this beautiful, delicious salad. So I usually make this salad a lot when I'm visiting my mom in Florida. I cook all of our meals when I'm down there for her and myself and my boyfriend. So I'll make a, a salad with one head of kale, but sometimes if I know that, like I, I could eat a whole head of kale by myself, so sometimes I will throw two heads of kale in there. This is not an exact science, for the ingredients, so don't worry if you add another head of kale, you don't have to have two avocados or something. It all depends on your preference. The more avocado you add, the creamier it's gonna be. So I eat a ton of this salad because it adds a lot of volume to my meal. So first of all, I enjoy it. That's the most important part of this. Like whatever you're making and eating, you really should be enjoying it. And, and I find this beautiful connection with plant food because it gives me energy it makes me feel good it just that is why I'm so passionate about whole food plant living because I've just never felt better this kale salad is kind of representative of that I eat a ton of it because I love it but then I'm also getting all the nutrients from it and it's also a high volume food so I'm super satisfied this salad gives me so much energy I love it sometimes if I'm just feeling like a salad I'll add something else to it maybe like tempeh more veggies or something but a lot of times i use this as side salad and pair it with whatever i'm making for dinner i have a super exciting freebie coming next week which is my top 10 favorite plant-based meals when it's ready i'm going to link it below so you can download it for free and have some awesome recipes for whole food plant-based dinner
me, leave a comment below. Let me know if you're looking for a recipe for something in particular, let me know below. And thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. And if you'd like an immune boosting grocery list, I have a link for that below. You can download it for free. I will see you again soon with another plant-based holistic health and wellness video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. And I will see you again soon.